Welcome back to my messy bench. I'm going to try a little experiment here. It's not really an electronics video, but it has to deal with electricity. I want to see if I can start a fire with less than one watt. And what I have is a tiny coil of wire. Let me put this lens on there. Maybe the camera will focus on it. Maybe it won't. Oh, yeah, beautiful. Let me center that better. Tiny coil of nichrome wire. And thanks to the do-it-yourself vaping community, you can buy nichrome wire off of eBay. And I'm using 36 gauge. I got all kinds of different gauges for making heaters and resistors and things, but that's the story on the nichrome. So I wound it around a very fine steel rod to make a coil. It's only like three or four turns. And I won't I have to get it very tightly concentrated because, you know, if it spread out too much, one watt of energy will dissipate pretty quick. You know, these resistors here, I think these are one watt resistors. They do get hot at one watt, but it's not hot enough to start a fire because the surface area is so large. To get this coil to glow red, I had to make it as tiny and concentrated as possible, and of course use the fine nichrome wire. I'm going to turn the power on. Oh, look at that, it's glowing red. Let's see if I can focus in on that. Look at that. Let's see how much power that is. Well, I have a meter connected in circuit here, and it's drawing 743 milliamps. And I'll have to measure with the meter here. I have to set the camera down and get a voltage measurement. I have to measure right across the terminals because at such a low voltage this thing operates. Measuring at the supply will give me an incorrect value. So hang on a second. Okay, well the probes are not connected now, but I was getting 1.3 volts. It was actually 1.29 or something. We'll just say 1.3. Moving it around dropped it a little bit. But um, the measurement I'm getting is 0.925. 925 milliwatts, so clearly under a watt. So... Will that ignite a piece of paper? Let's see if I can get this camera here. Yeah. This is my high production quality effort here. Oh yeah, it makes sparks. Oh, look at that. It does, it's not burning with a flame but it does instantly get a little red glow going there an ember like I guess you'd say oh the smoke is painful on the eyes there you go yep not a flame but under the right condition You could probably get that burning. So, yeah, very easy to burn that paper. You know, get it glowing at least with under a watt. Matter of fact, if I had thinner wire and I could wrap it tighter even, I bet I could get, get the paper burning under a half a watt. So you could easily make something with a AA battery 
because as you saw you know the voltage is low enough the current is definitely low enough that you can make something to start a fire with a single double a battery well that's it just wanted to see what i can do with some electrical resistive heating as far as starting a fire that's it thanks for watching